guys, welcome to today's video. What I'm gonna go ahead and do is a side-by-side -side comparison. This is obviously a tiny bottle of the Hourglass Vanish Foundation, and this is the new L'Oreal um, Infallible 24-Hour Fresh Wear Foundation. So I'm gonna do Hourglass on my left side and um, the L'Oreal on my right. I hope you enjoyed this video and let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so I have already primed my face. I went ahead and used the Tatcha Silk Canvas Primer and the Farsala Unicorn Essence. Like I said, I'm going to go ahead and use the Hourglass on my left side and I will be using a regular beauty blender with that. And for the Infallible, I'll be using this Real Techniques sponge. Now I don't know if this Hourglass is going to be my color because I did get it online. To be perfectly honest, I don't even know how much of this to apply. I've never used an hourglass foundation, so we'll see. Okay, so so far I do like the coverage of this one. It's not heavy. It's not sticky or anything, so it feels pretty good. I'm going to move on to the right side, and like I said, I will be using the L'Oreal Infallible. Uh, foundation. This is in the shade 425, so hopefully this works. And this one does have a little, a little pump. Now, for foundations that have this, I like to just go ahead and directly apply it to my face. This one is kind of runny, so we'll see. Moving on, I'm going to go ahead and use the Airspun um, Loose Powder. Mine is really broken, so I have to hold it very carefully. I actually have to take this top off. No, I forgot to do concealer. Okay, so now that I've already set the foundation and concealer, I am going to go ahead and move on just to the rest of my makeup. I want to keep this really simple since this is about the foundations, so I'm going to go ahead and probably zoom through this and just do my everyday makeup routine. Okay guys, so the camera cut off just as I was doing my blush and bronzer. For bronzer, I used the Physicians Formula Butter Bronzer and the Benefit Dandelion Blush. For my eyes, I went ahead and just used bronzer all over and I went in with this Tarte Rainforest of the Sea uh, 3 palette and I just used the shade Compass. I picked it up with my finger and just applied it on my lids. Then I used the Maybelline Master Precise Liquid Liner and the Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. So now for my eyebrows, I will be using the CoverGirl Ultra Fine Brow Pencil and this is in the shade Soft Brown. And then for highlight, I think the camera cut off when I was doing this also. I did go in with the Anastasia and Anne Rizzi highlighter. I'm just going to go ahead and use a little bit of that to highlight my inner corners and my brow bones. Take it. And so for the lips, I'm going to be going in with this Bite Beauty Lip Crayon. I'm going to say that this is in the shade Glossé just because the E has a little accent. I don't know. We'll see. Okay, so now to set the face, I'm going to be using this Smashbox Photo Finish Primer Water. Okay, so as far as the foundations go, I do like the way that my skin looks with both of them. I have the L'Oreal on my right and the Hourglass on my left. I really do like the way that both of them are sitting on my skin. Everything looks really um, smooth and meshed together. Nothing is... Nothing is in my in my lines just yet, so I do like them. I will continue to use both of them. I am going to try and get my hands on the full size when it is released. I don't know when that will be, but I will go ahead and um, list the information down below. Anyway, you guys, that's it for this video. I hope you liked it. 
um, let me know in the comments if you want to see anything new, if you want me to do a different type of video for you. If you end up purchasing either one of these foundations, go ahead and let me know. Um, also, please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already, and ring that bell for notifications. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.